that is making you evil, isn't it? <laughs> ah, I'm nitpicking, but uh, at the same time, he's possibly act what he's saying is actually meant to be in agreement. You know, you have to be able and willing, or able and uh, ambitious. Also, of superior regicide mask. Interesting name. But yeah, I'm just nitpicking basically. The ambush mitts make me think of the rowers, kind of. Also, this. Uh. Should go here. We'll make the AoEs better. Uh, so this will be hitting even further out. Because that's now cost as an AoE thanks to the other tank. We probably won't perceive the increase in distance. But it is there. And that's what matters. In all honesty, those uh, stands probably won't have a nice on it, but it's always worthwhile hitting, uh, just in case. I know in Diablo, uh, Diablo 3, I got a legendary two-handed sword off a random peasant corpse. So it's just like a case of, you know, and can happen. Though, then again, that's a different game, not this one. So, yeah. Huh. That's doing less damage. We hit T. Suddenly it jumps off, but it's still doing less. Am I missing a buff? I just fixed my headset. Um, am I missing a buff? Hmm. Needs a bit of gear. I haven't changed that now, though, have I? <sighs> I wouldn't know. All right, though. Mad Gladiator and Bearded Devils. It's the GOAT guys again. Feels like I'm back in Diablo. Like, honestly, the game looks really nice from this angle in this degree of light. Pit Cackle. Energy Weaver. But yeah, in this light and, you know, whatnot, and from this distance, the game actually looks pretty nice. Seriously? Strictly to level 45 or below? Come on, game. Uh, 56. 59. Yeah. Nice. Actually, I should head back down below for one second. And, um... Just activate the other thing. I know they'll, they'll cark it, but say a V, that doesn't really matter. Oh, did I already activate it? Yes. Uh, dripping, uh, dripping blood and weeping tears. No matter how far you climb, you never escape. You never escape the pits. After we're done here, there's not too much further to go. Not too much further. A bit, but not too much. Which you know if you've already played the game. Oh, sorry, already played the game or watched me play it. Shackled Hellions. In, grab that. Somehow the scrolls don't burn up in the fire, but I sure as hell do. How oily are you, uh, Ganeth? How oily are you? You have to be pretty fucking... Oh, I never noticed her up there. It's considering she are disappearing, the blue flowers, she must be the love of Dressa. His desire. At age 13, carving knife in hand, I killed beasts for the amusement of the filthy. At 15, they thought me worthy to fight a fellow man. A butcher he was, twice as big and twice as stupid as I. I butchered the butcher, and many like him, earned my way kill by kill out of the awful pit and into the grand arena. I thought, I would find wealth and glory in the arena. I was wrong. 
was wrong. I found something far precious. My Lady Merve. And we know how that story ends. She gets a gem implanted and... Oh Christ, that almost looks like a guy's brains. I think it's meant to be hair. She gets a... Oh Christ. Uh, she gets a gem implanted and... Really so she can sing with a particular lady's voice. And she goes kind of mad from it. And she turns into a siren when the nightmare comes. Raining toad. Enemies are slowed. Mine. Uh, use the banger as well. Okay, here's another uh, important guy. So, well, important. Stink Slasher the Monstrous. We'll use him to help budget these guys down. My god, is there a ton? Really? Five. It's kind of what happens when you have so many sealed stuff. I kind of need to go grab... Um... No, I need to grab that, but there's a thing over here. Uh, that's nice. That's nice. And that's really what I want. Reduces mana reserved. All there. And increases effective non-curse uh, non auras. B basically meaning this will be better. And the anger will be better as well. So, that will be nice. But I'm not sure how vital that is to my um, the style of play. You know, I might be able to do quite well without it, or maybe not. Also, I'm noticing those gladiators have knives in their stomachs, and they're throwing knives. Is that meant to be a sign that that's where they're getting the knives from? Because I, I, it's kind of hard to tell. Also, Heavy Strike. It's, uh, Christ, it's a very low level tank. Uh, it knocks enemies back on hit, and deals 150% uh, uh, base attack damage, and 25% reduced enemy stun threshold. It's very nice. Very nice indeed. But um, I won't be using that. I like uh, Wild Strike way too much. Wild Strike's a very nice. Like, just look at the amount of physical damage it does. I like the music here. Like, I really like the music here. It's very nice. It is a game I've been wanting to play for the last bit. Maybe by the time this is out, I'll have gotten to it. But uh, it's the Elder Scrolls MMO. I've uh, been wanting to get to that for the last while. Also, that got shunted along the ground. Damn. But yeah, I've been wanting to get that for the last uh, little bit. And because uh, I've been hearing cool things about it. It's not meant to be a great MMO, but it's meant. It's, some of the customization sounds interesting. So I'm willing to give it a try and see what it's like. Um, could make some videos out of it, at least make that back, you know, like, get some attention to the channel kind of thing. So, um, uh, you know, it wouldn't be an all, a complete wash. Um, you know, even if I don't like it. But it, some of the stuff does sound interesting. Like, someone was talking about making a tank that uh, heals when they get hit, and heals when they hit, and they can heal their allies if they do a strong hit, as well, like, heal themselves and their allies, uh, if they do a strong hit, and it's it's actually a really cool thing, like, I, in that case, I could make a DPS guy who could heal himself when he beats someone up, and wouldn't that be beautiful? Of course, it may gimp me on the damage a bit, but out of extra survivability, well, that sounds nice. So it, it sounds like a really interesting game in terms of custom, a bit of customization, and I wouldn't mind giving it a try. Um, I'm a little iffy about uh, its uh, payment schemes, though. Uh, you can buy the game, but then there's, I think, microtransactions. I'm not sure if what they're like. I see in the collector edition there's some XP boost, um, and that's typically a sign that you can buy XP boosts in the game. And, you know, other such microtransactions. 
where they go beyond just simple customiza customization to actual game affecting shite. I knelt in the sand of the Grand Arena, awaiting the killing blow. I raised my eyes to look upon my death. Instead, I saw her. Merveille. Her beautiful eyes met mine. And I knew she saw me too. I turned my opponent's strike and killed the man with his own dagger. Fighting had always been about survival. The primal instinct to kill or be killed. Now, the fight became about something else. Love. Regretfully, the wrestler never did get a happy ending. He kind of... He got his shit one. He, he leaves to quest to find his love, a cure for his love, and he ends up, you know, dead. It's, it's kind of a rough deal. Merva, Rudeus, Felix, uh, and Dimitri Cassius. Sorry, just kill my way through the uh, Roman Republic. Don't mind me. Come on, get back here, you pansy. Get back. Come on. Thank you. Just wouldn't sit still. ADHD, maybe. Regardless, uh, you, you. Uh. Nothing there. Yo. No. Okay. You. Okay. I'm just gonna run run around something in all these. Okay. We'll brawl here. Uh, I was just thinking as I was running that I'll probably run far enough so that the others will just run back, leash back. So, no real point. I couldn't just brawl them all down using each other against them. Wouldn't work. Uh, I'm gonna pop back, sell some stuff, pop back here, yeah, do it a few times. Yeah, I got some things what from Nightmare. Fine. Totally won't have any negative effects. You can trust me, I'm a boy scout. You will be remembered. Uh, you know, scout's honor and all that. Semper Fi. I am no beast of burden. Come on. There we go. Now. You. Yeah, you can go there. And you. Go there. Okay, we're popping back. No room in the inventory. Not the inventories really don't have much room. What is which is it, a bit XI? irritating. Go where you are needed. Pop them back in. Uh, here at the end of the arena, there's an optional uh, dungeon and there's a non-optional dungeon. Uh, optional part. We went into the non uh, non-optional, so we'll f uh, fling ourselves over to the other one. Um, for the extra loot and whatnot. Though really, we didn't really clear the other side, did we? Oh, oh, t tortured blasphemer. Yes. Kill you, kill you, kill you. Gotcha. Beautiful. A random skull on a guy. Oh, it was on one of my guys. Huh. Weird. Uh-huh. 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 Okay. Prehistoric claw. Interesting. So this is an arena, not a... You know, uh... Museum. Not really that great. The increased element of resistance is nice. Uh, but it's not enough dexterity to warrant it. Plus, I don't really care too much about dexterity anymore, do I? That was just for, uh, repost. I suppose I'll probably care about dexterity when this is evolved. Because I don't think I can really level it up any further than it already is. No, I can a little further, but that's it. A little irritating. I 
anything else here? Yes, these shackle can aliens. Let's move away from the fire. Might be a good idea. And some uh, bearded devils. Can I be honest? Part of me almost feels like replaying through the album. Uh, I'll probably regret it though. It's not as much of a fun game as this is. Like, I'm, like I said before, I'm not a fan of this genre. This genre doesn't do it for me. It used to when I was younger, but not anymore. But this, the, and it's such like Diablo was painful to me. This, on the other hand, while it's not the most fun of experiences for me, it's, um, I was just checking the sta condition of the statue there. Totally it had broken as well. Uh, while this isn't the most fun of experiences for me, I really do enjoy it. It's actually a very fun game. Um, even though it goes against the genres I like. So, yeah. I'm, I just, I think... This is making the... Um, I, since I'm really enjoying this, I think it's kind of almost, in a way, making Diablo look, seem better. Like, I'm liking this genre more now because of this game. So, because Diablo is in the same genre, I'm thinking more positively of it. If you get, if, you, if it makes sense. Like, say if I found, I was really into fancy novels, and I found a fancy novel that I really liked. I'll, I may want to reread a fancy novel I didn't like in the past, thinking maybe I'll appreciate it more now. It's the same case here. Oh, actually. I thought I was going straight into the fight with him. Oh yeah. Already claimed one. And kill you. Nice. Anything of interest? No. Plenty of random religious signs though. Oh you, you exist. The previous King of Swords was a giant of a man. Both faster and stronger than I. Yet I needed only look up at my Lady Merveil to know that I had no choice. I could not die this day. I made him shiver under every parry, striking with all of my might so that my arms felt they might snap with every impact. All the while, I studied his face, watching for that moment when he began to doubt. It took an hour, but finally it was there. Burning with pain, Empty with exhaustion, I stepped inside his faltering swing, and I slit the giant's throat. I did not take my default. I knelt in the sun, looked to Merveil, and cried out for my lady's hand in marriage. From that day forth, I wore the crown of swords upon my head and the ring of eternal love Upon my finger. Uh, the part it's already leave out is she had a gem implanted where she could sing in the voice of a particular lady. And it drove her mad. And she turned into the siren. Um, back in Act 1. So, yeah. And she was going to... And she's had various kids since. I'm not sure how. What did she do? Is it just like, you know, rape a sailor? Um, or did she. Can she just, you know, knock herself up? Or are they not biological kids? Just beasties she's calling kids. Who knows? Um, but yeah, it's a much sadder story. He dies on the journey to try and find her a cure. And he ends up here somehow. The nightmare willed itself. So. A king of swords is nothing. And he's not even it's noticing the it's horrific it's mutations. Christ. It looks like straw here, but it's all blades. The rest of the king of swords. Move. Yeah, I'm staying over the fuck away from that. Okay, he was doing cold damage? That is nasty, considering. He will slow you down so you get